Hi guys, Harriet here from Caroline Painting. I'm just going to do a quick DIY tutorial for you guys for, uh, for paint access. It's just um, showing you how to use this product, Sickens. We're going to be using it on this timber batten up here, as you can see. It's an oil-based paint, so you can use it on um, fresh timber, or this was actually previously painted in oil-based, so it's absolutely fine to use on that. You can use it as a base coat, or you can use it as a free coat top coat. That's no problem at all. It's pretty watery, so just be careful when you're mixing it not to move too quick, and just give it a good stir like so. Change in direction, and make sure you're just all the way to the bottom. This stirrer is from Unipro, as you can see, which is great for the stirring. Just stir it for about 30 seconds to a minute, just to get all of the paint going, like so. The bucket we've got here is from iQuip. So make sure it's completely clean inside. You don't want any other kind of paint in there as you're using Sickens. So just give it a good clean before you pour anything in. The tools we've got for you is this Unipro Smooth Coat brush, just to paint the surface of the baton. And then the uh, foam brushes that I actually saw a Daiho painter using. So he just used this um, foam brush just to get into the sides of the baton. So that's a really great tip. Just make sure to take up some sandpaper and then a dust brush. Just give it a sand. Make sure you follow the grain when you're doing this side to side. And then just give it a good dust after. Right, I'm going to go up there now, so I'll see you up there. Hi guys, so I'm up here now, so I'm just going to show you how to do it yourself. So I've already sanded the whole thing, so you just need to get your sandpaper, go side to side like so, just get that nice and smooth, always follow the grain. Once that's sanding down, just get a duster brush, it can just be an old paintbrush. Dust that down, get rid of all of the excess dust. Then the next step is just to get the foam brush that I was talking about in the previous video. Dip it into your paint, just not too much. And then just grab it and just run it side to side. It fits perfectly in between the batons, which is great. Just go side to side a couple of times. This is the trick from a Doha painter, so thank you for that. No worries. And then just grab your brush. Make sure to wipe it on the side of the part a couple of times, just because oil-based paint's obviously very watery. And then just side to side, paint in the base of the baton. You need to do three coats of this and just make sure you give it a light sand in between each coat. Just get it nice and smooth. There we go. Thanks, guys.